Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Double Life Challenge. Uh, you may notice we are sleeping with a different woman today. Um, you also may notice a change in hairstyle. Somehow when I did my, my CC purge, her long straight hair got lost. So I just gave her this because um, I figured Lucy is the kind of the kind of new young mom that would like Google mom tips and she probably read somewhere that it's easier to parent a toddler with short hair. So she went and got her hair cut. Um, and I didn't realize until after I gave her this hair that Emma has the same exact hair for her formal wear. Like I just didn't even do that on purpose, but it's fine, <laughs> whatever. Um, yeah, I decided to go back with Lucy and Duncan Sorry for the interruption. My mother left a meatloaf in the oven and I was in charge of uh, taking it out of the oven when it beeped because she's out shopping. So I had to go, I had to go get the meatloaf because the oven was beeping. But as I was saying, I decided to get back um, with Lucy and Duncan for this episode because we were in the other house for three days and um, Madison Keeler, one of my faithful commenters, love her, she said that I should stay if the twins' birthdays were soon and leave if they weren't. And they have six days till they age up, so I figure I'll stay here for three days um, and then stay with them so that for three days that they'll age up on the third day. And then we should be back in time for uh, Duncan's birthday by then. Because that's uh, three days there. Yeah, no, we should, we'll be fine. Um, but yeah, so here's Duncan. He's all, he's all asleep in his little crib. Um, be sure to check out my Instagram for his makeover. Also, Lucy has more decent clothing now because she kind of looked, she still looked like a little, like the little strip dancer that she was. But um, her outfits, those outfits, those like, you know, those revealing outfits, the scandalous outfits are still there. But I just gave her some more like outfits for some more coverage. I mean, it is, it is fall and she is a mom now. So she just probably wants to look more decent. So she, all of her, her um, promiscuous outfits are still there, but I just added another one using dresser. Um, and you'll notice I renovated the house just a little bit. It still looks crappy, but I used every cent we have. I mean, we only have $68 left. And like, you know how when you like move Sims in and out, it like takes money with them. So like Chris brought back like 1,000, 1,000 simoleons to this, to this household, um, which makes sense story-wise. He would bring back money when he can. Um, so we only have $68 left because I got, we didn't have a stove before. I got a stove. I got another counter. We got this couch. We got the TV. Um, we got toys for Duncan. I got a potty for Duncan because he needs that now. And we actually put in a separate room for the bathroom and a separate bedroom. So yeah. Oh, and we got a dresser for the bedroom. But that is all of the renovations. I'm going to hit play and stop talking. And my timer's going. Very good. Very good. Um, oh, here's the paper kid. She's stuck. Nope. There she goes. Okay. Well, can we uh, speed things up here? Get out of bed. I should have just cut to when they were awake. Uh, Lucy's going to serve waffles. She started making autumn salad, but I stopped her. It was like 2 a.m. when I moved back over here and, like, they were all awake. And she started making salad at 2 a.m. And I said, no, don't do that. <laughs> all right, come on. Get up. You're fully rested. Your bar is full. Come on, Lucy. Duncan's not going to be happy when he wakes up. He's going to be very hungry. And he's going to be stinky. Ah. Oh, yeah, she's kind of standing in the middle of the bed because I... No, don't... No, put on put on your nice clothes. Put on your, your mom outfit. Every day, too. Please. Look, see how cute she is? I love her. It's a very cute outfit. I found that on... Uh... Pixel Sims, I think, is the website. They have some awesome stuff. All of my brand new CC is from Pixel Sims. I love them. Um, can I move this? Can I not move this? Okay, well, we're going to keep that there because I wasted $5 on it. And so help me God, we do not waste money in this house. <laughs> Here she goes. She's such a mom. Oh, no, Duncan's awake. He's going to start screaming. We also, our goal is to get him ready to age up while we're here, so he has the wish to teach him to talk and to potty train him, so we're going to do all that before we move back out. 
Um, let's see. Chris is going to react to this noisy sim we got right here because the baby is a Karayan. Okay. You're very hungry, but your wife is cooking. You're not. Oh, that is not your wife. Your woman, your side hoe, <laughs> is, is cooking breakfast. So just be patient. Um, can you change his dirty diaper, please? Come on, booger. There we go. And then can we feed him on the floor? She's still cooking. Let's hope she doesn't burn it. Oh, she didn't! For a first time cook, not bad. Not bad at all. There he goes. He's got his food. He's all good. All right, Chris, grab a plate. Oh, don't continue. Just take the waffles. Enough with the salad. We're gonna sit on our nice couch and we're gonna eat. Look at that. Look at her. She is just precious. She's trying so hard to be a good mom. And Chris is trying his best to support her. Um, while we're here, I definitely, definitely want to get it on with Go Bias. And I have, I have a bit of a devious plan in mind, so just bear with me there. Um, so, we're gonna hang out with Go Bias once Chris leaves to go to the library to write for the day. Or maybe he won't, maybe he'll just stay home today. He doesn't really have to write. Um, okay. Oh, the baby's playing with his music. He's a go baby. Okay, um, can you, why don't you continue cooking this? Just because, like, we can just put it in the fridge. Chris, make yourself useful. Uh, do we not have, oh, we don't have a sink. Oops. Well, that's awkward. I probably should invest in one. You can't play with him because it's against the wall. Um, oh, also, we have festival tickets, so I'm going to just sell those because I don't know how to redeem them. So, Yay, now we have more than $100, $161. Perfect. Um, you're a little stressed, so why don't you watch some TV, my boy, my boy Chris. As soon as she's done cooking, we are going to go visit our boy Go Bias. There we go. All right. I'm going to put this in the fridge. We'll have that for dinner later. Perfect. She just bas basked, grasped the basics of cooking. She's going to pee. And then we're going to go see our boy that Chris doesn't know about. <laughs> All right, Chris. Um, oh, shoot. Lucy has work. Just kidding. We're not going to see Go Bias. Dang it. Dang. That's a shame. Okay, well, Chris, can you teach... Teach Duncan to talk? Because you can. Did you just break the toilet? Girl, why are you like this? Unclog it. Alright, so when does she get out of work? Okay, when she... She gets out at 7. When she gets out of work, we are going to go right to Go Bias' house. We are not going to bother coming home. We're just going to hang out with Go Bias. Just going to speed through all this. Yay! We unclogged the toilet. We're so great. Alright, can we put on our... Um, oh, well, she's going to do it anyway. Put on your work clothes and go to work, miss. She's still earning $30 an hour. Which is, that's, you know, that's $90 that we'll have that we didn't have before. So, you know. Let's just zoom in on these guys. They're so cute. And if you'll notice, for this episode, I have a new thumbnail. I did a photo shoot of both of the families, and it was super successful and super cute, and I love all of them so much. So, um, all of the Sims are in the new thumbnail, and everything is great. Um, I'm just going to keep speeding through this. do to do Ooh, my mom just texted me that she's buying an avocado. Yes! 
<laughs> I love avocados. <laughs> Hmm. Do do. He's learning so quick. How's his bladder? Oh, her, her, the phone's ringing. The phone is ringing. We should answer it, cause it might be our dear, our uh, it might be our dear wife. We should definitely call her while we're here, just to keep the friendship going up. We could call our daughter too. Oh, it's it's an opportunity, cause there's no face here. Oh, it is. No, it is Emma. Do we want to hang? Oh, God. Uh... <laughs> we can't. I just... Um... I can't leave the baby here. I'll chat with you on the phone. We can chat. Let's, let's chat. Let's chat. He's going to play with the peg box. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that could have that could have been awkward real quick. <laughs> Why does he know them? Why the heck? Why are Chris's other kids in Duncan's relationship panel? That doesn't make any sense. They're not in Lucy's. So why does Duncan know them? That's weird. That's really weird. <laughs> Can you work hard while you're there, please? Can you get a promotion? Because your performance kind of sucks right now. Why does her mood bar look bad? Why does that... She's in a good mood. She's in the green. Oh, she doesn't have any positive moodlets, I guess. Just chatting with our wifey while our side hoe is at work. <laughs> How's the relationship? It's getting up there. Let's see. He, oh, he's going to pee soon. So when you're done, when you're done on the phone, can you please pull a train Duncan? Potty train Duncan, and then use the toilet yourself. Okay, stop playing. There we go. Good job. Good job. Um, yeah, we'll, maybe we'll call her again. Oh, wait, I'm going to direct her to go to Gobias's house. He lives alone. Such a lonely bachelor. Look at that. Potty training, our kid. We are such a good dad. She just got $90. Very nice. She's going to go buy us his house. This is going to be lit, guys. I'm so excited. <laughs> Alright, after you're done with the toilet, please finish teaching him how to talk. Let's pop in with Lucy. I want to see. I want to have some fun with Gobias. Like I said, I've got a trick up my sleeve. So, oh, there are two people here. What's going on? If the lot would load, I could see. Who's that? Who is that? Oh, they're in the house. Never mind. <laughs> He's going to let us in. Here he is, guys, our sugar daddy. I wish she had the mooch trait. Then she could, like, ask him for money. That would be so funny. <laughs> oh, when we're still in our work clothes, that's not good. When we're done being let inside, I'm going to put on not the... We're not going to put on our mom everyday wear. We're going to put on, like, the, the promiscuous outfit. Yes, indeed. Okay, let's... Let's change into everyday two, which would be the promiscuous skirt, fishnets, tight vest. Who is this guy? Oh, he's a friend. Listen to compliment. Oh, he's going to compliment us on our, our nice outfit. Yeah, boy. He's, like, in love with us. Like, we never initiate any of this. Like, he's, like, in love with us. 
Um, let's see, let's flirt, let's hold his hands, let's, we're not gonna stay over because our baby's gonna need us. Um, compliment his personality, tell him he's hot. Ooh. Yes, go bias. Yes, go bias. Go bias. <laughs> Such a hottie Magadi. We are teaching him to talk. He is oh learning to talk. Very good. Ooh. Let's see if he does anything. We just stand here for a little bit. No? Okay, never mind. I always like when the other sim initiates stuff, but if he's not gonna, then that's fine. Um, flirtatious? No, don't joke. That'll ruin the mood. Um, amorous hug. Where's he going? Bruh! Where are you going? We want to hug you. Oh, he's going to the bathroom. We should probably let him do that, but, you know... It's fine. How many lifetime reward points does she have? Oh, not enough. I really want to. I really want to give her the mooch train. <laughs> I really want her to be able to mooch money from him. Yeah, she needs twenty thousand. That's a lot. That is quite a lot. I really, really want her to mooch money from him. Can we? Can we kiss him? Okay, um, hold his hands again, still teaching him how to talk, thanks for being very alluring, let's, let's embrace him, give him an amazing massage, yes. Yes, go bias. Yes, go bias. I really want to mooch money. Because <laughs> he's rich. Oh, my dogs are barking downstairs. Sorry if you can hear that. Yes, go bias. Oh, he still doesn't think we're being extremely irresistible. Can we make out? Why is there no make out option? I'm I'm offended. Kiss him again. Give him a smoocheroony. Yes. Are we extremely irresistible yet? Yes, we are. Okay. Let us there there is like no rule that says I have to do that. I just like to do it. I, I feel like it it makes the foreplay make sense. Oh, his room is huge. Oh my god. Um Risky Woohoo with Go Bias. Wait, that's the trick I had up my sleeve. Hang on. Um Woohooer Risky No, not horse. I don't care. <laughs> um, it's, we're, I'm going... My trick up my sleeve is I am upping the success rate of um, Risky Woohoo because I, I'm i not going to do it on purpose. Like, I'm not going to, like, deliberately try for baby, but I think it would be hilarious if... <laughs> If Lucy got pregnant by Gobias and like tried to play it off with Chris as if it was his baby, I think that would be hilarious. So I'm I'm doing it. We are gonna risky woohoo it up. Yes, yes, Gobias. Mm. Yes, boy. Follow them upstairs. Oh, sorry if you heard that. He really has to pee. <laughs> and we are leading him to woohoo and he has to pee. 
Also, we probably should like take care of our kid, maybe. I don't know. Um, let's see how this is going over here. Let's see. How is his talking going? Where's the bar? Come on. Where is the bar? All right, well, either way, we're going to stop because we need to uh, feed him on the floor. Um, where's the fridge, though? Why is there no fridge? Hello? Ugh, the lot takes forever to load. Oh my lord. Come on. Alright, he's got his bottle. What is the issue? Okay, there it is. Eat leftover autumn salad. Yay. And then put in crib and then go to sleep. Are they doing it? Have they done the diddly yet? Oh, sorry. If you could... Oh. Never mind. <laughs> oh, she's not wearing her, her sexy sleepwear. <laughs> Speaking of sexy sleepwear, damn, look at this boy. <laughs> Damn, go bias. Get it. <laughs> Guys, I'm... St <laughs> Look at his little rubber ducky pajamas. <gasps> and that cross-eyed look he's giving. Go bias. You are our some... You got me feeling some type of way, go bias. Let me tell you. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. That's hilarious. What are you doing? Oh. Oh my god. Go bias. <laughs> he just freaking peed himself. Way to ruin the mood. You know what? It's it's his his old man bladder. He just he couldn't hold it in anymore. We just made him too excited. <laughs> like can we just make that a thing that Lucy Oh, now he's going to cry. Poor boy. We'll comfort you. We will comfort you with our our lovely body. Let it be known that Lucy made Gobias too excited, and he peed himself. <laughs> oh, Gobias, you, you old coot, you old coot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna title the episode Gobias, you old coot. <laughs> oh God, now we're gonna sleep with a smelly, stinky man. Yuck. All right, Chris is in bed. All right, Duncan sleeping. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, and that's my timer, guys. Oh, hang on, they are just not here. Where'd they go? Okay, so like, she's really tired, but she should really go home, right? Like how suspicious would it be if she just didn't go home? Would that be suspicious? Can we have one more woohoo? Just one more? One more, or is he gonna go to sleep? He's probably gonna go to sleep. He's going to sleep. Never mind. All right, Lucy should go home. I'm gonna have her go home. But I'm gonna end this episode here. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed this this little this romp with with Go Bias <laughs> with the old coot himself. <laughs> oh God. Um. I really want her to be a mooch because I really want to mooch money. I'm honestly, guys, I might cheat that. I think I might, I might, um, I might just cheat changing her traits if y'all don't mind. I mean, what's going to happen? You're not going to burn me at the stake or anything, right? Let's see. Yeah, because you can't, I can't change her traits until she has 20,000, and I don't play with her enough to get her that hot. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna get rid of, maybe I'll get rid of, I'll get rid of party animal, because she's really not a party animal anymore. She just, um, because she's a mom now, she doesn't party. She's still, oh, excuse me. She's still flirty. So I think I just hit my microphone. 
she's still flirty and a great kisser. Like, she still, you know, likes to have her, her woo-hoo with all the men in the town, but she's not really a party animal anymore. Motherhood has, has dampered her partying a little bit, but not her woo-hoo. Um, so I think I'm gonna get rid of party animal and get mooch, because I feel like motherhood would naturally, like, make her a mooch, like, if she wants money to, you know, help with the kid, but, you know... So we're swapping traits because motherhood changed her. That's what I'm going with. Otherwise, it's just that I'm cheating. But I'm doing it for the story, guys. For the story. <laughs> okay, I hope nobody minds. But anyway, um, I think I said this already, but thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, don't forget to comment. Uh, let me know what you think of this old coot. <laughs> Um, let me know if you like Lucy's new look and if you like Duncan's little makeover I gave him. Don't forget to check out my Instagram for, uh, detailed shots of them in Creatisim. And don't forget to check out Instagram for, um, shots from my photo shoot that didn't make it into the new thumbnail. But, um, I think that's it. This is Simmerose. Have a lovely day, you guys.